Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel, <clears throat> Jesus TV. My return subscribers, God bless you all. My new viewers, you're welcome. If this is your first time of viewing my channel, you're welcome. Please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Don't forget to like and share my videos. And don't forget to comment my videos. Okay, so, mm hmm. Uh, Ogori Marian and Onya Fife have still decided that Ogori Marian continues as the Olu of Ileyefe ever since Queen Naomi returned. Because a lot of people have been saying that um, Olori Marian is not the Olu of Ileyefe, that um, she's just acting, that Queen Naomi remains the only um, Olu of Ileyefe and is still the Olu of Ileyefe. Okay, now let us not say that Queen Naomi is no longer around so we can't say if she's still the yellow of Ilefe or Oromeran is just acting you know it's just um acting as the yellow of Ilefe. well i'm sorry to inform you all that uh Oromeran is still there and of course you already know that Kwenomi doesn't even want to have anything to do with the palace and she's not going to even take up the uh position again because the position comes with so much responsibilities so and of course you all know if she doesn't want to have anything to do with um um uh, royalty no not like royalty like doesn't have to have anything to do with the palace that means uh she will not be there to be carrying out her responsibilities so olori marian is still there and as she is your law of belief she's the one carrying out the responsibilities she's the one taking care of things she's the one making sure that everything is put in order and in place of course you already know that if she's if she olori marian is not there olori ranker is the acting <clears throat> will act on her behalf as olori ashley is uh a nursing mother now and uh, she needs to take care of herself and so she won't be around for every other thing and all that so, uh, for people always saying that uh, Olori Marian cannot be the yellow of Ileife, Queen Naomi still remains there. Except if Queen Naomi accepts to uh, return back to the palace. But for now, she's still married to her husband, but she doesn't want to have anything to do with the palace. That's the way it is. So, she's currently in Lagos, uh, where Honor Fife bought her a house. You know, she's there with her son, Prince Tade, and that's where she's been. <clears throat> she's handling most of her ministries from of course her ministry is in Ekiti state so sometimes she goes back you know to do her, the the work of god and sometimes she stays in she can actually handle them from social media and all that so my beautiful people this thing is not this um this there's nothing there to fight over they are all matured they all know what they want and they are all living peacefully. You all can even hear when you heard when Honor uh, Fife said that he is now a happy man. He doesn't have any right, any reason to regret uh, the prophecies of the Ifa priest. And of course, everything is just moving on well for her, for him, sorry. And you know, his wives are behaving well. They love each other. They do things together. They plan things, they plan things together. And, and they are all doing well. And most people are saying that all this for all this is for glam. Some people are saying that it's just to make sure that people doesn't have anything to say because on her fifth year married um many wives. Of course it's not the only it's not the first king that married uh like five to seven wives and all that and and he won't be the last. Other kings, of course he's is is one of the known kings in Yoruba Kingdom and in Nigeria. So uh it is his it is his um right as a king to have as many wives as he wants to. He was just the one that wanted only one wife. Well it is good to want only one wife but according to him that was the prophecy of the Ifa priest and he's glad he respected his pro the prophecy of the Ifa, Ifa priest and everything is moving just fine for him. My beautiful people, that is what is happening now. Olorimeran is doing the needful as the the Yolu of Ileife, the current Yolu of Ileife. And of course, with the help of other queens to direct her. Because uh, she's not from this part of uh, Yoruba. How do I even put it? So, most of the 
cultures abi tradition in, in Ilegwe is a little bit new to her so they had there to assist her to put her through in anything guide her in anything that she wants so she's doing just fine and she's handling that position just fine and queen naomi on her own is also happy so my beautiful people this is what is going on and please if you've not subscribed to my channel please do well to subscribe to my channel don't forget to like and share my videos don't forget to comment nicely have a blessed day bye